It's been two weeks since the massive 9.0 earthquake devastated Japan. As foreign search and rescue teams leave the country, the focus shifts to cleanup efforts. Shane, what can you tell us? Well, Alyssa, the big concern now is radiation from the damaged Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. Trace amounts of radiation have been detected in milk, spinach, and in the water supply of Tokyo City. But public health officials are saying the radiation levels aren't enough to pose a public health risk. Now, back at the nuclear power plants, helicopters and teams of firefighters have been dumping water on the reactors to try and keep them cool. But the disaster is likely to have ripple effects around the world. The Japanese economy is the third largest in the world, and in the two weeks that financial markets were opening following the disaster, the Japanese stock market fell by nearly 16%. Cost estimates for rebuilding have been put at $200 billion. Companies like Apple, Sony, and Toyota have been forced to stop or halt production while they assess damage. Now, economists are saying that the damage likely won't be too devastating in the long run because the region wasn't densely populated and Japan has experience rebuilding from earthquakes. So Alyssa, as long as the nuclear situation doesn't get any worse, it looks like the economic toll won't be as bad as the human toll. Thanks for the update, Shane.